Hello, my name is Dr. Marlene Helm, Acting Superintendent for the Fayette County Public Schools, and this is our weekly video update from the Helm. We continue to have great success with in-person learning at every school across the district and are excited about plans to continue on-campus instruction during the summer with our innovative Summer Ignite programs. Looking ahead to the start of the 2021-22 school year, we anticipate a full return to in-person learning, welcoming back students who are currently attending school remotely. Any family interested in virtual learning for their children next school year should complete the application for the Virtual Learning Academy before the deadline of midnight next Friday, May 14th. As we close out Teacher Appreciation Week, I'm here at Lafayette High School, where 2021 High School Teacher of the Year, Christopher McCurry, has started an effort to inspire future generations of educators. Chris, thank you for being with us today. Will you tell us a little bit about this amazing project we've heard so much about? Yes, ma'am, absolutely. Back in the fall, a team of Lafayette teachers got together to discuss how to have an impact on uh, our school system, both in the short term and the long term. And we decided to uh, start fundraising for an endowed scholarship. And I'd like to shout out a few of those team members because we worked hard on this uh, idea all year. Joe Gross, Stevie Lemons, Leslie Davis, Dara Feltz, Lauren Chiro, um, Susan McLaughlin, and our principal, Brian Jacobs. Thank you all so much uh, for coming together to work on this, uh, this project. We know nationally that, uh, and locally that most teachers are white, but we believe that all students will benefit from a more diverse teaching staff. And so that was one of our goals. What an admirable goal. Can you tell us a little bit about this amazing woman that uh, you named the scholarship after. Yeah. Helen K. Swade came to Lafayette in 1955 as a 16 year old and she was the first student to integrate Fayette County Public Schools and in her honor we're establishing a scholarship at the University of Kentucky and hoping to endow it uh, in the five years that we have to fundraise for it. And she's an amazing woman, a local legend and I, we want everyone to know her name and to know her story. Chris, share with those who are listening and watching how they might help by donating to this scholarship. The initial fundraiser is a GoFundMe, and the link is on your screen. And Dr. Helm, what we really love about this fundraiser is Helen Case Wade went on to become a teacher. So if you could donate during this Teacher Appreciation Week, we would love that. Thank you, Chris. Your advocacy for students, social justice, and the teaching profession is a testament to the kind of incredible educators we have here in the Fayette County Public Schools. During a week when we're supposed to be celebrating you, you are instead laying the foundation for a brighter tomorrow. This has been a wonderful week, celebrating the hardworking men and women throughout our district who have had an impact on the lives of so many. Although nationally, this is a time set aside for teachers we know that every adult in our school district has a hand in educating our students. We asked members of the graduating class of 2021 to tell us about those who helped them get to this point. And it was truly heartwarming to read the notes they submitted about the bus drivers, principals, custodians, teachers, counselors, social workers, and others who have helped them throughout their 13 years of schooling. It is fitting that today is also National School Lunch Hero Day. Heroes make themselves known in many ways, but they share one common trait, always looking to help others. School lunch heroes can boldly and proudly proclaim that during the darkest days of the pandemic, they powered forth serving 3,148,819 meals to students and their families between March of 2020 and April of 2021, using their gifts, talents, and super culinary powers. They provided students and their families with a daily dose of hope and sound nutrition. Fayette County Schools is blessed to have wonderful employees, engaged families, and a supportive community working in concert to ensure that every student achieves at high levels and graduates prepared to excel 
in whatever future they can imagine.